I told you last week about Diamondback Energy putting forth a $20 million equity investment toward Verde Clean Fuels. That's a renewable energy company with technology that can capture natural gas that is wasted during flaring and turn it into gasoline. Tyler Dupnik caught up with Keys Van Off today, the president of Diamondback Energy. And Tyler, joining us now with more on how they came to this decision. Tyler? Yeah, Alex, and speaking with Van Hoff, it was obvious that they were excited about the partnership with Verde, and it's also obvious that and they also want to try to get a plant up soon. They decided to commit that $20 million you mentioned as they view Verde's technology as a unique way to tackle the industry-wide issue that is flaring. The amount of cost improvements as well as technology improvements in this, in this business continues to astound me, and, and I think that gives me a lot of a lot of hope for, for this business and the Permian to uh, be a, an engine for oil production for a very long time. As innovation continues to improve the oil and gas industry, Diamondback Energy has taken a step forward to try and reduce its carbon footprint. And then it kind of fit with Diamondback's strategy to try to decarbonize the oil field and, and you know, make our barrels here in the Permian the lowest cost and lowest emission barrels you know, in, the, in the world. The energy company is currently working on getting its first plant active with Verde's Syngas to Gasoline Plus technology, a reality that would cut down on flaring while adding jobs and revenue. We need a, a, good, a good location. Uh, we need a steady supply of, of gas to make it happen and um, you know, also need to make sure the economics work for, for us and, and our partners and, and we have the capital to, uh, to put to work. Vant Hoff says they don't want to flare as burning that gas means losing money. He believes the Permian Basin has done a good job of trying to decrease it, and with this being an industry-wide problem, it has been a collaborative effort for businesses. The large companies actually are working together very well on this on this issue. Um, I think we see, um, you know, environmental performance as an industry issue, not just a Diamondback issue or, uh, you know, a competitor's issue. So, so in a lot of ways, um, unlike in drilling and completing wells, we do share a lot of information when it comes to environmental performance and what's working and what shareholders are saying. And so I think that that generally means an industry that's going to move forward together. Now, Van Toff told me this is only the first of many investments as they learn of more opportunities to reduce their carbon footprint as efforts continue to decarbonize the oil field. He also mentioned in our conversation that they hope to build a couple of plants utilizing Verde's technology. Alex.